it is getting into the summer months again, so that means it's getting hot and the sun is out, so here is a friendly reminder. You are not immune to ultraviolet radiation, and you are not immune to skin cancer, and you are not immune to sunburn. Sunburn, and a bit more seriously, skin cancer, is caused by ultraviolet radiation doing damage to skin cells and DNA. So the sun damages skin cells, and then the immune cells go to the site of the sunburn and clean up the dead and damaged cells, which causes inflammation, which causes sunburn. Skin cancer is caused by the result of a mutation due to that ultraviolet radiation. It um, mutates the DNA in the cells and causes cancer to take place as uncontrolled division of those skin cells. And this happens to everybody, regardless of skin tone. So, most people, I'm assuming, know what melanin is. Melanin is the molecule that causes pigmentation in skin and hair. The more melanin you have, the darker your skin tone. And melanin is protective against ultraviolet radiation. However, it is not full 100% protection. Like, if you have more melanin, you do get sunburned less and you are at less of a risk from skin cancer, but it is not perfect and you can still get skin cancer even if you have a dark skin tone. So, melanin is ultraviolet protective and the more melanin you have, the less severe sunburns you get and the less risk of skin cancer but it is still there. You can still get sunburns and you can still get skin cancer even if you have a very dark skin tone. It is a common myth that like darker people, like black people and Indian people, they cannot get sunburnt and they cannot get skin cancer, but that is a myth. It is not true. Like I, lots of people say like you can't get skin cancer and sunburn if you have dark skin, but that is not true. You may be at less of a risk for skin cancer in sunburn, but it can still happen. Like, sunburns are often less noticed in dark skin color because when I get sunburned, I turn into a lobster. It is very visible. But when people with darker complexion get sunburned, it's not quite as visible because it's on a darker palette and it's not the bright fire truck red. And in a more serious case with skin cancer, often case studies on for, ca uh, for cancer only are involving skin cancer on white complexions. So it is far, far underdiagnosed in people with darker complexions because doctors aren't totally sure often, not all the time, they aren't totally sure what to look for in people with dark complexions, so skin cancer often gets missed and underdiagnosed. This is unfortunately due to systemic racism in the medical field. Often conditions present differently in light and dark skin tones, so skin cancer looks different on a darker complexion person than it does on a lighter complexion person, and often doctors are only trained in looking for it in lighter complexions, and so it often gets missed in people with darker complexions. Because doctors often, again not always, do not know what to look for. So even if you think, like, oh I never get sunburned, I don't need sunscreen, yes, you, you are still at risk for, even if you don't look sunburned or feel sunburned, the ultraviolet radiation can still be doing damage that can potentially result in skin cancer. So everybody, please wear sunscreen, protect your skin regardless of your complexion.